Parliamentary Updates. Senator the Honorable Timothy Hamill Smith, the President of the Senate, delivered the feature address to students of Point Fourteen East and West Secondary Schools during the resumption of Parliament Schools Outreach Program. The presentation, entitled Parliamentary Privilege, was delivered on Thursday, October 16, 2014, at the Point Fourteen East Secondary School. At the beginning of the program, students were shown a brief presentation on the facts about Parliament. The Senate President then began his presentation by defining the word privilege which, according to Dictionary.com, means a right, immunity or benefit enjoyed only by a person beyond the advantages of most. Therefore, parliamentary privileges can be defined as a right or benefit enjoyed by members of Parliament belonging to the House of Representatives and the Senate. One of the most important parliamentary privileges enjoyed by members is freedom of speech. But this freedom has its limitations. Members are only granted freedom of speech when speaking during parliamentary proceedings, such as sittings of the House and the Senate. Freedom of speech is also extended to written works created by members. These may include matters that are brought in a member's name, such as a bill or petition, and any publication covered under the authority of either house, such as reports. Another privilege enjoyed by parliamentarians is the freedom of access to the parliamentary precincts, that is, the chamber and areas considered to be part of the parliament. Simply put, no member of parliament can be arrested for a civil matter on his way to or from the parliament. However, an MP can be arrested if he commits a criminal offence. Parliamentary privileges are established for several reasons. One such reason is that they allow members to conduct their business without external intervention. These privileges are also important to the general public as parliamentarians are given the freedom to discuss issues of a national importance in the sacred halls of the parliament chamber without fear of prosecution. Still, members must ensure that they do not abuse these privileges since any instance of wrongdoing will result in their case being submitted to a disciplinary board known as the Committee of Privileges. This committee consists of a group of members of the House to which the member belongs. Following the committee's investigation, a recommendation is made highlighting the steps that should be taken to discipline the convicted member. Parliamentarians of the House or Senate then decide, through voting, what course of action should be taken against the member. Following the Senate President's address, students were allowed to ask questions during the question and answer segment. Joining the Honorable Timothy Hamill Smith at the head table was Mrs. Paula Gopi Schoon, Member of Parliament for Point Fourteen, Dr. Brinsley Samaru, Professor Emeritus at the University of the West Indies, and Ms. Keisha Peterkin, Procedural Clerk Assistant at the Office of the Parliament, who each took a turn answering the questions posed by the students. Some of the questions asked include, how were members of the Committee of Privileges chosen and if there were any recent examples of breaches by members of either the House or the Senate. This visit marked the sixth installment of Parliament School's Outreach Program. This initiative was launched in March 2013 and seeks to build awareness of the role and importance of the Parliament in sustaining democracy and promoting good governance. Parliamentary Updates